Okay, guys, welcome back to my channel. So, this read is for Taurus. <laughs> go ahead and like the video, subscribe to the channel, and drop your tea in the comments. So, let's go ahead and jump right in. So, Taurus, um, the numbers that came for you was 1134. That may be significant for you guys. And then we have All My Life, um, Casey and JoJo. Okay. So, let's just get into the spread, shall we? Okay. So, there's definitely some type of choice or decision that somebody needs to make here. Okay. Um, I kind of feel like somebody don't want to leave a situation or they don't want to walk away from a situation. And I kind of feel like somebody is about to get some type of communication about this. Um... But I kind of feel like something was definitely just difficult, okay? So, it was like a real difficult, rocky situation. But somebody definitely has a choice. But I feel like somebody don't want to leave, like, their family. Or they don't want to leave a situation behind, okay? We have Earth sign towards Virgo Capricorn. Here, okay, the number 22 could be significant. You could be saying 222, okay? Or twos in general here, okay? Um, but something's very significant about this, too. But somebody don't want to leave a situation or don't want to walk away. Okay, we have this king of diamonds in the corner and this and this queen of diamonds. So these two people are a pair. Okay. Um, but somebody is like selfish, okay. Um, they could have had fellow financial issues, but somebody is like really, really um selfish and somebody is like super stubborn. Okay. Um so it's causing like a issue with somebody with the stability here within this connection okay and it's causing um the situation not to move in a direction that somebody would like for it to move okay or for it to go into a direction that somebody would like for it to go um but it's really like messing up the the finances because i'm getting like a financial issue as well uh here it's here yeah it's like things aren't growing or somebody is not opening up or things just aren't like growing with this person and somebody is like hoping that somebody will like open up and communicate with them here okay um because they really love this person they really want this person here they want to communicate so somebody could not be like really communicating so y'all can like really be in like the same place and not even communicating but somebody really do have a choice okay or whatever they got to do but it's like either this or that you know um, and I'm kind of getting this could be like an ultimatum or something or just a choice, you know, either you go this way or go that way. Um, but there's about to be some type of communication, um, coming through or message here. Okay. About like this from this person actually. Um, and somebody's going to open up about how they really feel and different things like that here. Okay. Um, and I kind of feel like somebody, this is what somebody really wants. Like somebody really wants a deep, raw, um, conversation here. Um, yeah, a deep, raw conversation. And I kind of feel like, um, you know, it's difficult. It's, it's really difficult, um, in the situation with whoever this is. It's like a huge burden, okay? Um, it's like fighting tooth and nail and there's just too much conflict here. Um, when all somebody want to do is just move forward passionately and, but they don't want to deal with you know all of this conflict okay um at all somebody just want to move forward passionately you know somebody wants to shower somebody with like attention and uh you know praise them and different things like that but they can't even do that because somebody is like stubborn or I don't know, like, they's, like, stone cold, like, I don't know, they give off, like, a stubborn, stone cold, like, type of energy, especially, like, when this person don't get that way or something like that is what I'm picking up, okay, but this person definitely loves your cooking, so, you guys have really good chemistry, um, when you guys are around each other, that's what I'm picking up, you guys have excellent chemistry, and they love your cooking, they like it a lot, um, we have meet me at the hotel, okay, so, but is this in reverse? I think it is. So somebody could have wanted you to meet them at the hotel or wanted somebody to meet them at the hotel. But they decided not to. So this could have been like um, somebody had a choice to, you know, hook up with somebody else. We have married life here. So somebody is definitely married to somebody. Okay. 
in a deep connection. That's what I was picking up with this king and queen of diamonds, okay? I was like, this is my soulmate or the other half or something like that here. So, this could definitely be a marriage, okay? And then we have telepathic communication. So, you and this person definitely, like I said, is, this is a soul connection here. Like, you can definitely, like, y'all have great chemistry. You can pretty much pick up on what this person wants and needs and vice versa here but we have somebody that's thirsty as fuck that's chasing your person or chasing you here okay and this is somebody who is just simple as fuck like all beauty and no brains so this is somebody who will do anything you know for attention or something like that here is what i was picking up they'll just do anything you know to get the attention of you or your person here whoever this is who's faced with this difficult decision here and they want to link up okay they want to link but i kind of feel like somebody is like no nah, i ain't doing that shit or whatever the fuck because that'll fuck up the connection with whoever this is you have this telepathic connection with right or something like that so the energy the way that you could be possibly feeling right now okay is we have the two of pinnacles in reverse so i kind of feel like you know you could be unstable or unsure at the moment. So this could be actually being presented to you or something like that. But you could be unstable or unsure at the moment here, okay, when it comes to this connection or this family connection here. You could definitely be putting up blockages or something like that here or burdens. But I kind of feel like you could be trying to protect, you know, your partner or whoever this is. But I kind of feel like you unsure or whatever the case may be here. And I kind of feel like you're trying to move away from certain energies and close a lot of shit out okay so this can have a lot to do with whoever this person is or whoever this is that is trying to like this thirsty as fuck they're trying to like get somebody they just don't have a clue they're not getting the clue they're not getting the message or whatever the fuck right so you know you're trying to move away from the situation here and close that situation out um with and this a romantic situation or you know some type of romantic situation because I kind of feel like you're going to need to spill some type of truth, okay, when it comes to this romantic situation or whatever this is here. You're going to have to spill, you know, this type of truth here moving forward, okay? Especially if you want to reconcile and celebrate and come together with this emperor. You're going to have to come forth with this truth or something moving forward, okay? So, it's something behind you that you kind of like unstable about you. It's like you already made up your mind, but you just ain't make the move yet, okay? This was going on to move away from it completely and close it out. So it was like you still entertaining whatever this is. So if somebody that's thirsty as fuck is chasing you, okay, who don't get the picture or who is dizzy as fuck or whatever the fuck. And, and they trying to get you to link up with them. But I feel like you ain't doing that because you already linked up with somebody that's, you know, that you already want to be with or whatever. But, you know, just need to move. You just need to be honest with yourself and move forward towards whoever this is that you really want and and drop whoever that is that you don't want pretty much so the person that you're thinking about or dealing with right now like they in this ten of cups energy you feel me so they trying to protect the family and shit like that here to protect your assets we have the justice card here so yeah i kind of feel like they trying to like protect and block they this is a protector here whoever this is so they protecting the family protecting you all that shit um yeah in this situation okay i kind of feel like this person is definitely very stern they don't play when it comes to you they definitely a logical thinker okay very logical um this person can watch like crime shows and shit so i'm getting like they watch uh true crime law and order um s whatever what is it uh i was about to say suv but i think that's law and order <laughs> I think that's like a, a Law and Order one, but they watch that kind of shit, okay? Uh, crime shows, <laughs> shit like that, okay? This is the type of stuff that they like to look at. Um, like court court shows, they probably watch like Judge Mathis and um, Judge Maybelline, you know, all them, Judge Judy. They watch that type of shit, so they, this is the kind of stuff they like. Um... But yeah, I kind of feel like, you know, this person is definitely a good manifester here, okay? Um, I kind of feel like they could definitely, you know, manipulate. If they had to go to court, they can definitely manipulate that way out of a situation. I'm just saying, they can. They really can here. Um, 
but I kind of feel like this person just want to move forward. You know what I'm saying? Um, they don't want to be manipulative. It's like they don't got time for the games. They just want to manifest something moving forward. Okay, they already know what it is they want to do. And they already got their mindset on what it is they want to do moving forward here. Um, I kind of feel like they want something to be balanced in this situation as well. Okay, especially when it comes to like blockages or whatever that may be going on between the two of you guys those blockages are going to end or this is what they want they want things to be balanced and they want these blockages to end here okay and they also you know been thinking about you know romantic romantically here like coming forth with like truthful communication here is they so i feel like an honest communication is definitely going to be coming forward between the both of you guys okay um because they want something moving forward here with you they definitely want some type of reconciliation or something like they want they see you like a future with you here pretty much this is what i see so they see that future here with you so we have look for a sign so all the signs is cautioning like i said you can see two 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 um twos okay um look for the signs in order to help you make this choice or this decision that you're trying to make here okay just the signs is all telling you you probably already know what to do you just probably was looking for confirmation or something you know but pretty much you already know what to do so we have give thanks for the blessings of love soon to come your way know that you deserve to be and have all that you truly desire. yes so love is ready to come your way and know that you you deserve to have it like it's all for you like come on now so the zodiac signs that came out was Pisces, Venus, a Pisces moon. We got Aries, Cancer, Aquarius, Gemini, Libra, Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces, Libra, all the fixed signs, Aquarius, Taurus, Leo, Scorpio. Okay, and then we have um, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Okay. Just making sure I ain't missing nobody. I'm not. And then the initials that came out for you guys was E, a Z, and the Q. Okay. So, yeah. Hopefully you guys got something from this reading. Go ahead and like the video. Subscribe to the channel. Drop your T in the comments. So let me know if it resonated. And I'll see you guys in the next one.